Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Saturday, December 12th, 2020. Free pick college football, USC, UCLA coming up on this update. Before I get to that, a quick note, if you've yet to become a member at DocSports.com, just want to give it a trial run, click on that link below the video, get yourself set up for a free $60 account, which you can then use on any of my daily packages or anybody else on the roster at DocSports.com. It is as simple as that. Get started by clicking on the link below the video. All right, we're coming to you early on Friday, earlier than we normally do to get you some time to be able to see this video if you want to jump in on the free play between USC or UCLA so we'll get to that in just a moment a uh, real quick note Friday's results not in yet and we'll report on everything on Sunday night as far as our weekend is concerned real quick programming note we will have our NFL video for Sunday available Saturday late afternoon at the latest late afternoon Saturday for Sunday's card so be sure to check back for that as far as what's going on for me on Saturday well football of course is uh, stealing the spotlight I guess you could say uh, if you're watching this before 12 noon Eastern 9 a.m. Pacific you can still receive all five of my remaining football plays, Saturday's college football, Sunday's NFL, Monday's NFL. Uh, it includes my top play of the week in college football, which goes at 12 noon Eastern. It also includes my one and only eight star play in the NFL for the season. It goes on Sunday. So the video will be up and so will the plays all throughout the weekend. So even if you don't get down early and get all those plays, you'll still be able to get the NFL Sunday and Monday, including that eight star play. And all my plays available in one place, and that is my my handicappers homepage over at DocSports.com. We'll also be involved in college basketball. Plenty of college basketball action to choose from. Uh, right now, as we speak, we're looking at halftime in our one college basketball side. Uh, we had a side in total. Total goes later, uh, but it's not looking too good. And we had a 10 and one run in college basketball with sides going back to late November, uh, but we're not looking good at halftime of this particular game. So if it bounces back, great, but we'll report on what happens on Sunday night. But again, even with the loss, we'll still be 10 and two with our last 12 college basketball sides going back to November 26th. Hopefully we'll get a nice second half here, come back and win this game and go to 11 and 1. Uh, but again, stealing the show on Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, college and pro football, eight-star play in the NFL, my one and only. You know, we cashed that college football eight-star by six touchdowns with Iowa over Michigan State. We'll go for the eight-star sweep this weekend in the NFL. All right, let's get to the free pick for Saturday's card, Pac-12 action. It is USC taking on UCLA. Uh, checking out all the lines right now on my screen in front of me, both in Vegas, in Nevada, offshore, all that good stuff. Looking at about uh, 16 bucks, three and a half for the most part. We have power rated USC a few points over that. So even though it's still moved towards the Trojans a little bit, this number, we still like UC, uh, USC. I, I'm kind of a DTR fan for UCLA. Dorian Thompson Robinson, the UCLA quarterback, uh, he does get banged up quite a bit. And I don't think he's going to have a ton of success here, at least not enough to put him over the top against USC. If you listen to people who talk about UCLA, they're going to talk about winning two games in a row. It's fine. It's true. But the bottom line is, if you watched that game against Arizona State last week, they had no business winning that football game. Badly out yarded. Uh, Arizona State fumbled at the UCLA one yard line. They also had another turnover around the UCLA 30. Wrong team ended up winning that game because of shooting themselves in the foot. I didn't have any action on the game. I was a neutral bystander, so to speak. And I came away thinking UCLA was quite fortunate to get through that game. USC has the offensive arsenal or weaponry or whatever you want to call it, especially at wide receiver to take advantage of what UCLA has a tough time doing and I think the Trojans are going to be just a little bit too tough offensively for UCLA to keep up so is it going to be a blowout I don't think so but I do think USC will cover this number of three and a half on Saturday so there you have it free play an opinion on USC minus the points over UCLA uh, don't forget star of the show for me this weekend eight star play in the NFL it's part of the all weekend package as you know five plays remain if you're watching this before for 12 noon Eastern time on Saturday college football, Sunday NFL, including the eight-star, and of course, the Monday Night Football play. We're involved in that battle between Baltimore and Cleveland, all available at DocSports.com on my handicappers homepage. Don't forget about college baskets and soccer and UFC. All right, if you like the videos, click on the thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe. Do appreciate those who have done so thus far. I'm Scott Sprites of DocSports.com. We'll be right back here late Saturday night, early Saturday evening with a free play from Sunday's NFL. We'll talk to you then.